is a no food uh, challenge. The patients came. guys welcome to another episode of uh, outdoor adventures so today we're going on a solo uh, sail camping adventure um, we're gonna try and do it with no food uh, we are taking water so it's the first time I'm uh, gonna try without food we got some fishing gear and I have a little bit of bait that I can use to hopefully catch our dinner tonight and uh, we're gonna go sailing now um, I think it's about a two three hour sail to our destination it's a little island um, of the east coast um, of uh, Nassau so uh, let's get on the boat and let's uh, start this adventure guys stay tuned so we're on our way to our uh, little uh, private island it's a tiny island about 50 meters by 50 meters and uh, from Google Earth, it looks like it has a little shore so we can uh, beach the hobby um, and we can do some fishing there and uh, we might have to gather some wood on the mainland and, but uh, the wind looks pretty good we can get a bit more speed here and uh, yeah, it should be I don't know, it should be about two or maybe three hours depending on the wind to get there. So um, I'll see you guys uh, in a little bit. Looks like a bit of rain coming there and I can feel it already so I'm going to put my rain jacket and try and stay dry. Well, <laughs> the rain has come. this point um, I would say we're about 500 to a kilometer 500 meters to a kilometer away from, uh, from our little island over there um, but I'm debating whether to go to the shore there because there's some fallen trees all along there that look like they've been uh, dead for a long time so it looks like really good firewood um, and I don't know what's gonna be, uh, you know, in the in that little island. I'm sure the resources there will be very scarce. So, might be a good opportunity to hop on the on the mainland and uh, load up on some wood. Change of uh, plans. We're not gonna go to the shore because there's so so little wind. So if I get in there, it's gonna be a nightmare to come out again uh, with lack of wind. It's already very very uh, light wind, barely making any progress. So. I'm gonna stay away from the shore and uh, chance it a bit on the island itself. All right, we're back in business. We got some, uh, we got some wind.
can do it. You can make it. <laughs> okay. This is as far as we go, guys. <laughs> All right. Okay. Not bad. Oof. What a what a beautiful. Oof. Guys. Oh my gosh. This is my island for the night. It's all mine, guys. There's no one here. And there's freaking firewood as well. Look at this. Oh, it's got to this. This will work. This will be fine. I'm sure there's enough firewood. There's enough resources on the island to get a fire going for sure. Ah. <sighs> Guys, this is amazing. Look at this. Look at these beautiful shells here. Holy moly, look at this guy. Beautiful. Look at this. Wow. This is paradise, guys. Well worth it. I'm so excited. Um, what, we gotta watch the tide now because the tide is uh, rising. So um, yeah, we gotta make sure we don't lose our boat. <laughs> so we'll do that. All right, let's go. Uh, let's get set up. It hasn't really stopped raining um, since I've gotten uh, here on the island and I'm trying to set up and I, I had my inner tent uh, about to set it up and then it started raining so I tucked the whole inner tent into my uh, rain jacket I want to avoid uh, avoid getting it wet you know uh, but interestingly enough I was walking around here and check this out guys it's pretty cool here there's a little egg It's a turtle egg, I don't know. It looks like more like a bird egg, no? Check this out. That's pretty cool. Anyway, looks like the rain has finally stopped for a second. So I should put my tent up now. Take advantage. Let's go now. is coming up already you can see uh, where we where we started and the water is already coming up so we're gonna have to keep an eye on this and keep uh, moving it up as the tide comes up and uh, we'll exit on high tide tomorrow as well pop up yeah Thank you. 
All right, guys. So, little update. Uh, sun has already set. It's getting dark uh, pretty quickly now. It's absolutely beautiful here. The wind is uh, blowing southwest, and I got just the right angle behind me to, um, to cover myself from the wind. It's coming like just from here. If I step out, even you know, ten steps. You can hear the wind. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but you can definitely feel the wind. Big difference, you know. So, um, the wind direction doesn't change. We should be good. Nice, uh, nice little spot here. We've uh, processed all our firewood and kindling. I've been like extra careful to get really fine uh, tinder. I don't want to mess around. <laughs> I want to get it right the first time. And. Um, so as you guys know, this is a no food uh, challenge. I did bring water because, uh, you know, uh, I haven't done really any food challenges like this before. Um, so, you know, and, and like water in an island like this, you're basically hoping to collect some rainwater or find some kind of coconuts or um, do some transpiration uh, from the leaves or something like that. So that's not gonna happen. So I did bring water. Uh, and uh, I got a little bit of bait as well um, and that's gonna be my hopefully my chance to get a fish and uh, cook up a fish and uh, hopefully I will eat tonight guys so um, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm really happy right now it's just so beautiful here the wind has come down a little bit which is great um, I got my fire I'm gonna start the fire now so it'll be easier to just keep it going as opposed to start it later so I'm gonna get the fire going put some fuel in and then let's get fishing because I want to eat tonight guys so uh, <laughs> let's do this all right Yeah, baby. Coconut. Oh boy. Oh mama. We are all in here guys. It's tight. It's gonna be tight. It's gonna be tight guys.
All right, guys, we're leaving uh, camp over there. Fire is going crazy, exploding. Um, this is the bait that I have, guys. Okay, that's, oh, shit. Is that the rock? Oh, boy. No, it's not the rock. But it is, uh, I guess it's the wood. This is the bait that I have. This is the rod. I got a little hook and a little weight. Really small, basic. Let's try, guys. Oh, it's gotta gotta be careful getting snagged here, guys. So, uh, you know, I know I have like one or two hooks only, so really don't want to get snagged at all. Mm. Okay, let's get fishing. like that guys all right guys so I lost the hook already um, and and a bit of bait and uh, re-rigged. I got one hook left, so let's uh, hope we get it. We catch a fish. Decided to put the the rod here um, against the hobby, so I can lie on the hobby and wait, hopefully, for a fish to to bite. This is the actual light of the moon. So it looks like a full moon today. Look how much light there is. came and uh gonna be calm and uh hopefully we'll catch something guys god guys i have a fish oh my goodness i have a fish now we just have to land him please stay on the hook please stay on the hook one two three Yes, baby! Vamos! This is the evening size too. Oh, nice fish! Yes! Yes, baby! Yeah! Yes guys. This means we feed this means we can eat. Oh man, I'm so excited. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I, I thought I wasn't gonna eat today guys. There you have it guys, little grey snapper I think. Put him out of his misery here guys. He doesn't suffer anymore.
delicious guys mm. Mm. that's amazing guys that's that's so good that is so delicious I know it's because I'm hungry but it's not just ouch idiot touching the plate not just because I'm hungry guys generally it's delicious All right, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna enjoy my food, uh, finish this fish, and uh, I'll see you guys in the tent after this. Alright guys, so I'm tucked in now uh, in the tent, so that was awesome to catch that fish. Um, I don't think I've ever been so excited in my life to catch a fish, knowing that, you know, that meant dinner. Um, and it's such a difference in, such a huge boost in morale. Like, Thanks for watching guys so far and I uh, hope you enjoy the video. If you do, give it a thumbs up, that really helps. Anyway. Time to go to bed. Good night, guys. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you guys in the morning. Good night.
I didn't think I was gonna eat yesterday to be honest uh, it wasn't going so well and uh, time just kept ticking and uh, no fish no fish no bites nothing and then all of a sudden we caught the perfect uh, gray snapper perfect eating size as well no wastage so I was, I was really happy with that um, so it rained a little bit this morning and the night was actually quite cold I didn't bring any blankets or sleeping bags or anything and um, I think I should have I should have brought something else um, I, was, I was fighting a little bit of cold uh, in the night even with all my layers which is, I didn't expect it but I guess the wind maybe chills you um, so I had a wonderful experience uh, despite that fish I am still very hungry um, but that was great for last night it made me super satisfied and uh, it made the sleep uh, a lot better um, so I, yeah I had a good rest I, I slept till about uh, just short of six woke up a few times in the night as a standard when you go camping um, but uh, although, otherwise it was a great great experience that little island was beautiful there were no bugs which was amazing um, yeah it was beautiful we had a nice getaway we got perfect wind direction guys now um, so that should take us really nicely back uh, back home all right guys so uh, thanks for watching this video if you if you enjoyed the video uh, please uh, consider subscribing and uh, hit the bell notification symbol so you can be notified whenever we do any more adventures uh, thanks for watching guys I really appreciate it and uh, see you on the next adventure yeah